In ongoing efforts to align with the changing times that we're seeing, Quaker Foods says that they are going to drop the iconic image of Aunt Jemima from their pancake and syrup products. The woman who portrayed the role is actually Lillian Richard. She is an East Texas native, and Ken Molestina will explain a little more history of this woman behind the brand and also reaction from her very own hometown of Hawkins. Lillian Richard was born and raised in Hawkins and was laid to rest here in 1956. She put the town on the map after her work as the face of Aunt Jemima pancakes from 1925 to 1940. Today, signs into Hawkins proudly welcome you to the home of Lillian Richard. The state of Texas Historical Commission even declared the town the pancake capital of Texas because of her role as Aunt Jemima. When Lillian Richards took that role as Aunt Jemima, she did it as a career move. Bessie Peoples is with the Hawkins Chamber of Commerce and says Aunt Jemima's parent company, Quaker Foods, decision to drop her likeness as the face of the brand is wrong. I really feel that they're going uh, a little overboard and trying to overcorrect something that I don't believe was ever the intent. In a statement sent to us by the Quaker Company, an executive says, quote, we recognize Aunt Jemima's origins are based on a racial stereotype. While work has been done over the years to update the brand in a manner intended to be appropriate and respectful, we realize those changes are not enough. Here in Hawkins, it's hard to find anyone who agrees. I don't see where she has anything to do with what's happening in the world today. You know what I mean? A lot of people done ate them pancakes. I just don't see them buying a box without her picture on it. What is your message to Quaker, ladies? What do you what do you say to the company? Leave on your mom's picture alone. <laughs> Well, Quaker says they'll announce a new name for those pancake and syrup products later on this year. And by the way, Doug, Aunt Jemima has been the face of those products for about 130 years now, if you can believe it.